Howdy cowboys and cowgirls, I'm Cowboy Jack and today I'm really excited. I'm here with my friends, the Texas Bubblers in Houston, Texas, and I have got to find Shelly McBubbles. I wonder where, Shelly McBubbles! Cowboy Jack, hi, howdy, how, how are you? you? Good, Good to see you, welcome to my bubble lab. I love your outfit. Oh, Boy, thank you. You're I wearing that beautiful Texas flag and things, you got a hat just like me. All things Texas, Great. yes sir. Can I show you some of my bubbles? Absolutely, I'd love to see some bubbles. Well, this is my bubble lab. And I've got some super cool bubble tricks I can show you. But did you know first that we live every day in a world of bubbles? I've never really thought of it that well, way. Do you chew bubble gum? Well, yes, I do. Okay. Oh, how about this? Do you know what this is? Uh, bubble wrap? Bubble wrap. Did you know the bubble wrap was invented to be wallpaper? No. Yes, wallpaper. Yes, true story. There's bubble wrap. And, oh, what about this? Um, do you like to drink soda? Yeah, well, Ooh. I shouldn't drink as much as I do, but sometimes I do drink a lot Sparkling of... Sparkling water? Yeah. So if you shake this, what happens? Ooh, it can get pretty explosive. Should I shake it? I mean, you do you. Oh, <laughs> I love to shake it, because, you know, if we shake it, then there's... Because there's bubbles trapped in here. Well, you can't see them right now, but if I explode it and I shake it, don't recommend you doing this at home in your living room. Three, two, one. Ooh. Whoa! Right? Bubbles. Uh, you made me nervous. Then. I know, it's like bubbles. And what happens if you drink a bubble? Uh, it pops. Well, it pops out of your mouth, and what does it do? Oh, you make a little burp. Oh, you do. You make a burp. <laughs> now, what if you eat beans for dinner, and then you take a bubble bath? Ooh, you make Ooh. a different kind of bubble. <laughs> so your body is a bubble maker. Okay. You had no idea, right? I didn't ever think every of it Every single way. day. I guarantee you, every single day, everybody makes bubbles. One way or the other, they come out. Yeah, mm -hmm. our, very true. Our body's a bubble maker. We're a bubble maker. I didn't know Cowboy Jack was a bubble maker, but she just proved to me, actually, I'm kind of a big bubble do maker. Do you toot? Me? No. <laughs> oh my gosh, I bet you do all the time. I, Every day. <laughs> anyway, well, go on. So, can I show you some of my bubble wands that I have? Absolutely, I'd okay. love to see them. Well, here is, there's one of the bubble wands. And let me show you this one real quick. Ooh. This is a heart-shaped bubble. That is really cool. Do you think we could make a heart-shaped bubble? I have never tried. Hmm, well let's see. Let me do it with this one first. This is our regular bubble right there. Wow. Oh, and that was super cool. Now, in the world of bubbles, or in the world of world and math and science, do you know what shape my bubble is? Is it a sphere? Oh my gosh, you're so smart, Cowboy <laughs> Jack. I had no idea. So a bubble always wants to be a sphere. Ooh. And you can pop them, right? So much fun. Now, back to our heart. You think it's possible to make a heart-shaped bubble? Probably not. Let's try it. Should we try it? Let's see. Okay, you ready? Ooh, heart bubble. Uh, still yeah. comes out a sphere. Yeah, Look it does. Look how big this bubble is, exactly. guys. Always wants to be a sphere. So a bubble always wants to be a sphere, but in a little bit, we might be able to make some different shape bubbles. Okay. Maybe indoors and outside. Super cool. That sounds good to you? Absolutely. Hmm, so we talked about that. How about, let's see, hmm, what should we do next? I have, oh, I have some, a couple other bubble wands. Can I show them to you real quick? Whoa, let me get them for you. These are bubble wands. These are called what a- in the world? This is a tri-string bubble wand. Are you sure and these so are nunchucks? You can write. <laughs> <laughs> some kids use them like that sometimes, <laughs> trust me. And so this is a tri-string bubble wand, just some rope and some wind sticks or some plastic sticks. And outdoors you can make some really big giant bubbles. Oh, and okay. we'll do that in a little bit. Would you like to go make giant bubbles? Absolutely, that'd awesome, be amazing. Awesome, awesome. But let's do some inside first, shall right, we? Yeah, we're Okay, here. we'll put these down. <laughs> put that down. Hmm, let's see. What kind of bubbles? Oh, would you like to put your hand in a bubble? Absolutely. Okay, but first, okay, we have to get your hand juicy, so you have to roll up your sleeve for me. Okay. All right, Cowboy Jack, we're gonna get our bubble wand. We're gonna see if you can actually put your hand through a bubble. Well, first, let's see, can you do this? Whoa. Hold out your right hand for me. Oh, he's getting his hands ready. He's getting all I gotta, juicy. I gotta be, I'm, this is, a, you're a professional bubble maker, so I gotta bring my A game. Oh, I've been, I've been, you know. You've been making bubbles a minute? A couple minutes. Okay. Apparently, I have too. So do me a favor, hold out this hand real quick. We're gonna see if you can hold a bubble in this hand. Oh, hold on. Oh, no. Cowboy Jack, it keeps popping. Well, why can't I hold a bubble? Have you ever taken a bubble bath and played with bubbles in the bathtub? Absolutely, I do it all the time. And how do you do that? Your hands are? Soapy. Soapy, very good. So should we get your hands soapy? Okay. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna put your hands in the bubble juice all the way in. Bubbles like it's super, super soapy, super, wow. super wet. I know, does it feel wet and <laughs> slimy and cold and different, right? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna see if you can hold a bubble now. Are you ready? Oh, hold your hand out, please. Ooh. 
Look at that. What? Wow. That's not just a regular bubble, that's a smoke bubble. That is crazy. Isn't that crazy? Now see if it bounces. Turn it, oh. What? That's a bouncing bubble. That is so cool. Okay, now I'm gonna blow another bubble for you. We're gonna see if you can bounce the bubble on top of that bubble. Okay. Okay, is that okay with you? We'll do this bubble one. Hold on, let me switch. I feel like I'm playing with a big blob of, I mean, it doesn't have any weight to it at all. All right, see if you can bounce that bubble on top of that bubble. All right. Oh, I know, there it goes. <gasps> oh, oh. This is crazy. Oh. oh. What? Crazy, right? Wow, that was really cool. So if you can put your hand, hold a bubble. We'll see if you can put your hands through a bubble. Okay. Okay, deal? All right, yeah. get your hands good and juicy again. Get them all there good and juicy. We're gonna go a little bit further up the arm because you're gonna put your hand in a bubble and then you can <laughs> wave to all your friends, okay? This, I almost feel like I can make a bubble wand out of my own hand. You can. Try, have you tried it before? No. Okay, go ahead. Oh, look how fancy how cool you've gotten, right? And wow. It's like, what? You can make one and hold it, right? Whoa. Look at that. And you can flip it off. So, bubble, hand in a bubble. Okay. So I'm gonna make, I'm gonna use my big wand. Okay. I'm gonna make a bubble, I'm gonna catch it. Then we're gonna have, see if you can put your hand in the bubble and wave to everybody. All right. Deal? Okay, hold on. Here's our big bubble. What? All right, Cowboy Jack, go now, ahead and see put if you my hand Slowly inside. put your hand in through it. Oh, now wave. Ah. Look at that. Your hand this is inside so of cool. a bubble. Now yep. take your hand like, like a baseball, pull it out, just like that. Whoa. Whoa. Look at that, I took some of it away. You did. Is it possible to add you it back? You can try, see what happens. Uh, hmm. oh. <laughs> so speaking of that, do you know about bubble math? I don't know about bubble so math. So one plus one is what? Two. Not in bubble math. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna show you, can I show you? Absolutely. We'll do it this way. I'm gonna do one bubble. And then I'm gonna do another bubble. So one plus one equals two. Two. One plus one. Just one. One bubble. One bubble. Wow. You can take them apart. One bubble plus one bubble equals one bubble. That's bubble math. And that bubble math, and then now you that's can, not the math that we learn in school. This in is school not. math, <laughs> one plus one equals two. This is true. But bubble math. Bubble math is one plus one could be one bubble. I'm one big one, bubble. One bigger bubble. One bigger bubble. That's so cool because you have two individual bubbles and then they just combine into one big one. Yes, sir. Bubble math is awesome. Isn't that crazy cool? It's almost as cool as regular math because I love math. Oh, do you? I do. Mm. Maybe not that much. But. Okay. <laughs> Would you like to see if we could, hmm, I don't know, maybe light a bubble on fire? Light a, yeah, light yeah. a bubble. You guys want to light a bubble on fire? But before we go there, so with math and with what I do is we can change the gas inside the bubble to make it do different things. Okay. Okay, if a bubble, let's say, a regular bubble, how does it move? Does it float, fly, or does it fall? Um, I guess it falls, technically, okay. right? Okay, let's see, right? We'll, do your, we'll test your theory. We'll see if it falls. A bubble is, you are correct. Okay. A bubble's falling. Now, how about this? Now, can we make it float like side to side? How would we do that? Any ideas? With wind? Wind. So we'll do that outside in a little bit. Okay. How can we make the bubble go up? Any ideas? Ooh, I don't know. How would you do that? Mm, well, we live in Houston. We're going to do a rocket bubble. A rocket bubble? A rocket bubble. No way! No way. <laughs> All okay. right. All right, well, we're going to make a rocket bubble. This is our launching pad. Because we live in Houston, we have to have a launching pad. Absolutely. And so, But first, we have to have a rocket bubble, right? Okay. All right. Our, our, uh, Launching. Wow. Whoa. So that's a rocket bubble. That is not the rocket bubble. Technically, the one on top here will be our rocket because this is our launching pad. This might be the gas. Okay. To propel it, maybe. We'll see. Oh, oh. You know, in the world of bubbles, wow. you never know. I know. That's why NASA, you have multiple tests. Multiple launch pads. Right. That's right. Same thing with SpaceX nowadays. Wow, look again. at that, guys, that is so cool. Here we go. We'll put our rocket bubble on top. Trickery, here we go. There we go. Okay, now your job 
is to pop this bubble. But wait, we're in Houston. We have to have a countdown. Oh, we do have to Ready? have a countdown. Three, two, one. Yes, ma'am. Ready? Three, two, two one. one. Launch it. Whoa. What? Oh. That was crazy. Isn't that crazy cool? That was really cool. So those were like the rocket boosters and they went pop and they let go of the rocket. And exactly. Went, but that was amazing. There's science involved because what how did it go up? I don't well you filled it with that blue bubble over there. What is what do you have in there? You're so smart, Cowboy Jack. In here, have you ever been to a birthday party and they give you a balloon with a string on it and the balloon goes up in the air? Oh, yeah. Well, inside that balloon is a special gas called helium. Oh, okay. Mm. So inside here was helium, and helium is actually lighter than air, so it brought my bubble to go up to the ceiling. That's really Crazy cool. cool. That's right? amazing. A rocket and bubble. actually, you know, there's natural helium in our environment, but it's not concentrated. So when you do that pure helium, it's going to be less dense than the air. I mean, right? Right, exactly. It weighs a lot less than our regular air, and it's just, whoo, that was so cool. Would you like now some bubble tea? Absolutely. I Ooh. love bubble tea. Oh, have you had bubble tea before? I have. Oh, gracious. Well, my bubble tea is a little bit different. Hold okay. on. Let me get my other prop for you. So here we have our teacup. Right there. Well, we're getting fancy. Well, huh? you know, I may have you hold. You want to hold it? All right. Because you know, Cowboy Jack needs to hold things, right? So, and oh, let me get my little special. We gotta get it all ready. Are you ready? I'm just a little bit of water. Okay. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Gracious. <laughs> Let's do this. Oh, is now we want to. Oh, bubble tea. Let's do this one here. Is my there? It is. Hold on, we need a little bit more. Oh, trickery. <laughs> bubbles, the bubbles. bubbles like jokes. So there's our bubble. Wow. Probably you don't want to drink it yet, but there's no tea in it. That's our bubble. But now we'll do some tea. Okay. Are you ready for this? So we've got our bubble. <gasps> there's our bubble tea. Look at that. Ooh. It's going right through there. That is amazing. Oh, delicious and maybe not so nutritious, but you yeah, probably don't need to drink this one, but boy, that is amazing bubble tea. Isn't that crazy cool? That's so what cool. so why do you think the water went through there? I don't know. Well, my bubbles are made of soap, mm -hmm. water, and gas. So the gas is the air we breathe. There's soap within my bubble, but there's also water. So inside here was water. So if maybe if you take a bubble bath tonight. <gasps> You can practice bubble tea in the bathtub. That is so cool. Yeah, that's something we could do at home. That's really exciting. Bubble tea. I love it. Thank All right. you. Or you can put it right there. Oh, I know. No, <laughs> no. I'm not drinking this. No. One. Well, Cowboy Jake, so we put a helium in the bubble. Mm -hmm. What if we could light a bubble on fire? That would be so cool. Isn't that crazy cool? So, hmm. All right, let me think this. Are you, are you good with a, a lighter? Uh, I like to think so. Okay, let's see if you can light that. Let's see if you can get that part first. Oh my gracious, very good. Okay. All right, kiddos, make sure no one plays with fire. Yeah, well, hold on. You never want to play with these, and this is not a toy of any nature, right? It's correct. And so you have to be with an adult and let an adult do this part for you. In fact, probably best to see this part at an actual bubble show with a professional like my friend, Miss Shelly McBubbles here. Yes, are you ready? Should I'm we ready. Do it? All right, so here we go. We're gonna see if we can light a bubble on fire. Okay, Cowboy Jack, well, now, if you're going to light a bubble on fire, you have to count down three, two, one. Okay. And you get to reach really far back with your arm. Can you do that? Absolutely. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Light that bubble on fire. Oh, oh, I forgot the magic word. Oh, you forgot the magic word? There's a magic word. The magic word is abracapupu. Abracapupu. Okay. Abracapupu. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, we'll try it again. You ready? Three. Two, one, abraca poo poo. <laughs> You weren't expecting that, that was, were you? Yeah, I did not expect oh, that. Oh, just was really for fun, cool. should we do one more time? Yeah, let's do one more. Okay, three, two, one, abraca poo poo. What? Wow. Crazy cool. All right, now technically that is not magic at all. I am not a magician and neither are you. So what we did is I changed the gas on my bubble. Okay. I don't know if you saw it or not, but there's a special button in here. Okay. That I was able to press like this, and it holds the gas in my tube. I blew it out into the bubble. Oh, okay. And so the bubble was holding so that special gas. So you were using gas. a flammable gas Correct. to fill the bubble, yes. and then we gave it an ignition source, the fire, yeah. and that 
on fire. And then we just burned off all that gas into the, you know, into the atmosphere. Yes, we did. That was really cool. Isn't that fun? I loved it. So don't go home and light bulbs no, on fire. No, this is not something you would want to do right. at home. Especially like what you didn't see on camera is that I actually felt the heat on my arms and on my face. There was a lot of heat coming off mm -hmm. of that. That was really cool. Thank you for sharing that. You're with welcome. Us. All right, Shelly McBubbles, what are we doing next? We are going to do a cupcake bubble. A cupcake bubble? I know, I love cupcakes. You like cupcakes? I love cupcakes. I love They're cupcakes. They're my favorites. Now, we need the, some ingredients to make our cupcake bubble. So, first we have our warm water, okay. just from the kitchen. There's some warm water. But my secret ingredient is down here in my cooler. <gasps> Whoa. What is that? This happens to be dry ice. Okay. Dry ice is not wet. It is actually dry. It is made of um, carbon dioxide. It's frozen carbon dioxide. So it's not water at all. And so this is 110 degrees below zero frozen cold. Cowboys and cowgirls, that is one cold piece of ice. And you never, ever, ever, never, never, ever want to touch it with your bare hands. That's right, because that would actually damage your skin it, and kill your skin will, cells. It's way I too I accidentally cold. did it one time, and I got blisters. Yeah, well, that's like instant frostbite. That's exactly. terrible. So, but there's some cool science things you can do with dry ice safely. And so I'm using my tongs, and I thought I'd put the dry ice. So what do you think will happen if I put the dry ice in my warm water? What will it, what will it do? Well, it'll bubble smoke, right? It'll bubble smoke, it actually will boil cold. Oh, okay, I've never right? thought of it that way. So it's gonna boil cold and it's gonna go from a solid, but you see it's already becoming a gas right now. Right, that's a really cool process called sublimation. Very good, yeah. you do I so remember fancy. That. I loved biology and sciences when mm -hmm. I was in school. Mm -hmm. And sublimation is really neat because most things when they go from a solid, they have to go to a liquid and yeah. then a gas. But sublimation is direct from a solid to a gas. Very good. So should we see what happens? Yes. Are you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh. Wow, guys, look at that. That looks like something we'd see around Halloween time. Right. Now this is not, not cold, not hot, is it? No. It's... Not at all? Nope. So what I can do in order to make our cupcakes, so we've got our water, we've got our dry ice, but now we need our bubble. So let's create a bubble film over the top of it. Whoa, and we're gonna see how big that cupcake is. What? This is so crazy, look at it going. Now do you happen to see any colors by chance in some of the bubbles? I do see a lot of different colors actually. A bubble will actually refract light like um, the rainbows outside when it rains okay. and the sun, sun shines. Yeah, I can see, I mean, cause we're inside right now, but we have light coming in from outside and I can see like a lot of oranges some blues and greens. Now, whenever you want to, Cowboy Jack, you get to pop that bubble. Wow. But if you do do it, you do it from the top just gently. Okay. And see what happens whenever you want to. Well, how big you, should we let it get? It's how big ever you want to get. It. <laughs> how big do you guys think we should <laughs> let it get? I mean, this thing is growing really fast. I oh, can't, the anticipation is Right, getting... the hardest bubble trick is not popping a bubble. So you I pop know. whenever you want to. All right, guys, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and pop this thing. All right, let's count down. One, mm -hmm. Two, three, pop time. Whoa! <laughs> that was amazing. So cool, yeah? That was so cool. Amazing. <laughs> cupcake bubbles. I love it. Bubble tea and cupcake bubbles, right? All right, I like your gloves. Oh, thank you. These are my favorites. Actually, you just gave me these. I did. I don't because know what these are for. I'm going to see if you can juggle a bubble. Juggle a bubble? Yeah, you think you could do that? I mean, I can try. I like I like <laughs> trying. So what we're gonna do, I have my smoke bubble generator right here. Okay. All it is, is is some water, some tubing, and now I'm gonna add some more dry ice to it again. Okay. And we'll see what happens. Guys, get real close up and you can see when that dry ice goes in there. I just love dry ice, it's so fun. But you always have to be extremely careful. Here we go, you ready? Three, two, one. Wow. We're gonna put our lid on top. So we put our lid on top, it forces the gas to go down the tube. So this coming out of here is probably pure CO2. Yep, it is. Carbon dioxide. And we breathe that out. Yeah. It's like stinky breath. And plants breathe that in. They do. Very cool. Now it's not hot, not cold. You wanna feel it? Can you feel it? Yep, in wow. your arm, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. It feels like air. Yeah. Now if I take this, we're gonna see, hold your hands out, both your hands out. Get a little bit closer. We're gonna see if we can make some, um, smoke bubbles that you can hold and bounce. Oh! Wow. All right, now so what do you think? I try to juggle? Go ahead, go ahead and see if you can juggle. Oh. oh. Give me one more. One more, there you go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Come on, Cowboy Jack. Oh! oh. <laughs> so close! One more try, this come on. This is a serious challenge here. I tell ya. 
Oh, they... Oh, 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 yes! <laughs> At least you that can... That is so cool. You can bounce and catch a bubble on each hand. You ready? Here we go. I gotta try one okay, more go time. Ahead. Whoop. Here it goes. I made too many. Oh, 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 oh. Wow. Okay, two fresh bubbles, just because. <laughs> two fresh ones. There you go. Two fresh. All right. Oh, oh, I almost did it once. Let's do one, one, one from one hand, one to the other hand. Toss it to that hand to that hand. Oh, so good. Look at this. So Cowboy Jack, why doesn't the bubble pop? I don't know, is there something magical about these gloves? Those gloves really are magical. They're basically just kind of cotton and Bubbles love cotton. They pop on our hands when they're dry because of the oils and the grease in our hands. Oh, but when you okay. put on the gloves, whoa. So anything wet or clean cotton fabric, Bubbles don't pop. This is so cool. If you smash them, oh, they pop. I like it. Super cool. <laughs> this is so fun. Okay, good. Juggling bubbles, that's about it for that one. I like it. You've shown us so many cool tricks and I think you you said you have another really cool trick up your sleeve. I did, remember earlier we talked about the shape of a bubble is always wants to be a sphere. Right. Right? So in the world of bubbles, hmm, they said it was impossible to make a square bubble or what you call a cube. Uh huh. But someone says, I think it's possible. So I've learned that trick, I've been practicing. Now I'm not always perfect but I can try. Would you like to see me try to make an impossible cube bubble? I would love to see a cube Okay, bubble. let's see if I can do it. Okay, here we go. So, here we go. It's one bubble, right? Two bubbles. How many bubbles so far, Cowboy Jack? Four. Four. Do you see a cube yet? Not yet. Not yet. Okay, here's where it gets tricky. Oh, shall I make bubbles? Wait a second. Ooh, you There's see it? There's a cube right inside of there. There is a cube and it's actually its own bubble. That is so cool. Isn't that crazy? So when and things... So I see you had to combine spheres to make that little pocket for it and then it shaped itself into a perfect cube. It did. That is so cool. So you took something that they told you this cannot be done and you just kept trying and trying and you made one. It's true. I, I did. love that. That's perseverance and practice and just go get her attitude. I they say never when they said never say never. Never say never. Never say never. You never know what you Where there's do. a will, there's a way, and exactly. you just make it happen. So Cowboy Jack, um, what I love about Bubbles so much is that you can use your imagination. Okay. And, well, I love using my right, imagination. Right, and kids have the best imagination. I know. I'm always telling Cowboy Caden. Sometimes he tells me I'm bored, and I said, well, let's use your imagination. Okay. And he goes, well, I don't like to use my imagination, but then he starts to use his imagination, and we end up having a great adventure. Well, you use your imagination. I'm going to make some Bubbles, and you tell me what you think they, they look like. Ooh, this is fun. Okay. okay. All right. Here we go. All right, here comes the first one. I'm gonna make a bubble here. Ooh, we're gonna pop these ones on top, get rid of those. Oh, oh, the extra ones, we don't need those. Oh, I can do it. Here we go. All right, you tell me what you think this bubble might look like. Right now, I think it looks like a bubble. It does. <laughs> you are so fun. Here we go. Wait a second. That is crazy. It's starting to remind me of something. Cowboys and cowgirls, can you help me out? Do you think, can you think of what that might look like? I think it's something we've even done on the show. That looks Ooh. like a beehive. Oh, ah. In the world of bubbles, we call it a beehive. That looked just like a beehive. And now this we just call bubble brains. I like it, it's yeah. really cool. Or a bubble wrap, it could be any of that. Yeah, but that was looking just like a beehive. And we've actually filmed with a beekeeper. Awesome. It was really fun. Are you scared of bees? I love bees. I love bees too. I am a little bit, I don't like to be too close to them. But in that environment, we used the smoke and let them know we were coming in. It yeah. was really fun. Awesome sauce. Yeah. Well, sometimes kids think that my bubble hive, my beehive, looks like a disco ball. It, you know, it did kind of look yeah, like a disco Yeah, because kids ball. have great imagination. Yeah, I love that. No, it makes a great disco ball. Okay, I'm going to do one more bubble for you and see if you can tell me what this one looks like, okay? All right. Use your imagination.
What's it looking like so far, you think? You know what? Cowboys and cowgirls, that kind of... Wait a second. Ooh. That's like a caterpillar. Oh, it is a caterpillar. It's a perfect caterpillar. Look oh. how cool that is. It's like, what? Crazy things that you can do with bubbles. That's amazing. Mm. Shelly McBubbles, what am I doing standing inside this ring here? Well, I thought I'd put you in a bubble portal and then they would transport you to the Never mind. This is actually a kid in a bubble, but you're not, you're more, you're, we're gonna put I'm Cowboy like Jack. a really big kid. We're gonna put Cowboy Jack in a bubble. Uh oh, well, do I need to take my hat off? Leave your hat on. Wait a second, these guys are laughing at my hair. They're always laughing at my hair. Okay, I'll put the hat back on. <laughs> are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, don't hold your breath. Now, okay. here's the deal you can see in my bubble, you can breathe in my bubble, you can hear in my bubble, you can smell in my bubble. The only thing you don't wanna do in my bubble is toot. Okay, I'll Okay, do. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm ready. Here we go. Three, two, one. Cowboy Jack. In Whoa. Whoa. Let's that do was it again. So Let's cool. do it again. Let's do it again. What? <gasps> what? <laughs> this is so amazing. Whoa. Cowboy Jack, you were in a bubble. That is so cool. I've never been inside of a bubble before. That was awesome. All right, Shelly McBubbles, now we're outside. What are we doing out here? We get to use our bigger ones and make some massive, really giant bubbles. Do you like giant bubbles? I love giant bubbles. I mean, you just put me inside of a bubble. Pretty cool, wasn't it? It was really cool. All right, so I have my big bubble wand. Can I make some bubbles for you? And then I, you can give it a try? Sure. All right, hold on. So this right here. Now, the wind is my unpredictable business partner. Okay. He shows up sometimes, sometimes really hard, not in a great mood, sometimes quiet and soft. Right now, he's kind of perfect in a good mood. Okay. So I'm gonna stand on this side of my my station, and I'm. This is called the hundred bubble bubble wand. Hundred bubble bubble wand. Okay. Wow, say that five times. Right. Fast. All right. Are you ready? Here we go. Whoa. Wow. What? Now I know why you call it the hundred bubble bubble. Wand. Right. And it's so easy. You just pick it up, and the wind makes these beautiful bubbles. That's incredible. Wow. What? Those are huge bubbles. Would you like to try? Yeah. Come on, get over here. That was so cool. Now the trick to this one is keeping it closed when you bring it up and then go straight and go nice and tight All right. and go slowly. Here you go. Oh, very Look good. That. that was so hard, wasn't this it? This is so cool. So hard, wasn't it? You should wow. do it again. All right, here I go. Look at that. Now, I don't know if you know this, but bubbles are actually the shape of happy. They do seem like the shape of happy because I don't know how you could do this with a mad face. Right. Should we do the next one? Absolutely. Okay, you put that one down. This one now inside, we talked about the cube bubble, right? Uh -huh. And the sphere. So this bubble wand, and I'm using our imagination, this one we call it the jellyfish bubble wand. Okay. Because to me, it looks like a jellyfish when I it comes like up the wand. And then afterwards, we can change the weather. Would you like it hotter or colder? Ooh, I'd like it colder. It's okay. I can I have you go right there? Yes. Okay, perfect, because, you know, it's Texas heat. All right, so Cowboy Jack, this is our jellyfish bubble wand. So you want it colder? Yeah. All right, so first our jellyfish. Kind of looks like a jellyfish, <laughs> right? Now we're going to change the weather. You ready? I'm ready. Whoa! Whoa. Hey, look at that. <laughs> it's, <ooh. laughs> I got to taste those bubbles. I'm <laughs> ready. Right. Oh, no, you're right. You're right. What? Whoa. It's snowing all over us. It's snowing in Texas. This is so cool. I know, right? One look more time, me. just because, right? Just because sure, you like, not? you're like, let's just get you all soapy, right? <laughs> <laughs> this all is so soapy. cool. Snow bubbles. Wow, guys, I mean, look at that. We've got snow on the ground. This is like the icy peaks. I love it. I like it. <laughs> all right, so we did big bubbles. We did jellyfish and snow bubbles. What if we do a giant bubble? Oh, I'd love to see a giant Okay, bubble. hold on. I've got my, oh, it's right here. This is my giant bubble wand. And. I don't think I want to be downwind of no. that No. Here you go, are you ready? Three, two, one. Whoa. Wow. <laughs> a Look giant at that thing. Oh. Here comes the other one. Ready? Look at this thing. That's huge. That is so cool. Now would you like to try? Absolutely. Okay. All right, same thing goes. Just keep it closed when you bring it up and then open. All right, guys. Whoa! Whoa! Now I made you, like a giant snake. Should I have closed it back? You can up? open and close, or you can leave it open. Whatever you want to do. What? Look at that thing! Wow! That thing is traveling really far. Look. 
Wow, it they made it a really long way. Let me try that one more time. This is too much fun. Whoa, that wind's going really fast right now. Whoops. Wow, those bubbles are getting out there. All right, you want to go bigger? Sure. Because we're in Texas, right? Everything is bigger in Texas. I feel like we have to. Okay, so this one right here, this is called the Cuatro. Now, do you speak Spanish, Cabo Jack? Uh, mas o menos. Mas o menos. Okay, also, so this one would be our, called the Cuatro. Okay. In Espanol, Spanish, Cuatro is four, four in English. So what you do with this one, this one, so it's, if it's called the Cuatro, what do you think we'll do? Uh, make four bubbles? Yep. In the Spanish, burbujas. Okay. It's how you say bubbles in Spanish. Are you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. Wow. wow. Right? That is so cool. Okay, you want to try? Yeah. All right. So, same well, thing. Is now, hold, really long hold, it, hold it about right there. Use your forearms as leverage. All right. Just go straight up like you did before. What? Look at that. Those are beautiful. This is insane. Whoops. You know, I'm 38 years old. Right. And I have never made a bubble this big in my life. This is so much fun. And you are not too young for bubbles. No, never. My oldest bubbler was in his 90s. Look at that. <laughs> That is amazing. You want to go bigger? Sure. Okay. Right next to you is the monster bubble wand. Okay. Go ahead and grab the the you, These guys yep, right here. the blue ones. Yes, sir. All right. So go ahead and choke up a little bit. Now it makes one giant bubble. Okay. Okay. So there you go. Let me help you with the there. There we go. We got it perfect. All right. Same thing. Keep it closed all the way up. And then once you're up, then you can open. All right. No pressure. Whoop. Oh, Whoops. try again. Uh. Yep. Well, this is kind of like fishing with cane poles right now. It kind of is. It's like, whoo. I bet there's not too many cowboys and cowgirls out there that even know what a cane pole is anymore. For fishing, I know. <laughs> now walk backwards or walk sideways a little bit. There's Whoa. no breeze. So sometimes we'll have to have, there's no wind, right? The wind went away. My business partner went away. So sometimes it helps when you open it to go sideways just a little bit. Okay. And so you can make your own wind. Look at this. Right? <laughs> it's coming right at me. <laughs> so now can maybe it change directions. If it changed directions, then you change your body. Okay. And go into a different spot. All right. And open your bubble one. No All pressure. Right. Let's see what I can do here. Oh, trickery. Whoop. No bubble. Make sure all the rope goes in the bubble juice. There you go. Wow! What? That was huge! Amazing. This is too much fun. It's like a challenge. I feel like there's an ultimate level of finesse <laughs> Bubble and mastery. skill to this. Yeah. Oh, there you go. There you go. There it goes. There you go. Wow. Look at that. Thing. Oh, I was trying to close it off. Do it again, do it again, right? <laughs> All right, here we go. There you go. Ooh, oh, 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 so close. I right? was close. So close. One more try just for good measure, right? Exactly. This is going to be a keeper, I can tell. Whoa. <laughs> wow. That's so cool. Okay, I've got one last bubble wand for you. But I'm going to do it for you first. All right. Okay. So the next one is, is one of my blue bin. This is called the Bubble Cloud. Bubble Cloud. This is the fan favorite. Okay. It's, it has a nickname as the Bubble Bath or the Super Soaker. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right. I don't know where we want to stand, but hold on. So. I'm worried with a nickname like that. I, I feel right? like I'm about to get. <laughs> Super Soaks? A little bit. Yeah, a little Bubble Bath. You said you like Bubble Baths, right? I do. <laughs> Three, two, one. Wow. That a is a ton of field bubbles. field of bubbles. Oh, we're just getting warmed up. Usually number three and four tries are better. Here we go. 
My goodness. Isn't that crazy cool? That's insane. So there'll be a sea of kids in front of me and everybody's soaked, popping, chasing bubbles. Look at this. Uh-oh, I'm in bad shape here. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, what? You want to give it a try? Yeah, I have to. This okay. is amazing. All hey, right. That looks a lot like a fishing net. It, you know what? It actually is. This is so cool. This is a little little challenging, but uh, we'll give it a try. Keep it closed again. All right. And do the same thing, and then you just have to open it with the wind, one behind you. There you go. Oh, that was so hard, wasn't it? Wow. This is crazy. You never knew you could do bubbles with so many different things. No, I did not. This is amazing. Huh. This Shelly McBubbles, what do you have there? That looks like a, uh, what is that? This is my super duper foam blaster. Okay. I can blast you or your camera person with foam. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready? I've got to see this. Right? Oh my gosh. Better practice on her first. Oh my gracious. So I'm going to get my, my bubble sock here all soapy and wet with my bubble juice. And I'm going to turn it on. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Look at that. That is crazy. That is insane. Look at all these bubbles. That is so cool. I shouldn't have touched it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, ha, oh, it's all over you now. So like, yeah. So yeah. That, that is a crazy foam blaster. Isn't that crazy blaster? That is really cool. One more time just for fun? Yeah. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Look at that. I mean, that makes a really rich, thick foam. Imagine if you had that in the bathtub. That would be a whole lot of fun. It would be a lot of fun. That is so cool. I love the ingenuity of it. Nice. You, you absolutely made something incredible. I, I don't know where you get your ideas, Shelly McBubbles, but I love it. I the love your creativity. The secret is this is a leaf blower. No way. No way. Seriously? It's a super duper leaf blower. Okay. Crazy that, cool, huh? That is really cool. I love it. All right, cowboys and cowgirls. Wow, Shelly McBubbles, thank you so much for having us thank, today. Thank you for being here. I think Texas Bubblers and what you do is absolutely incredible. Thank I you. had such a blast. I mean, I'm 38 years old going to be 39 pretty soon and I had a smile on my face from start to finish and I hope you guys really enjoyed it too make sure you're following along because we go on all kinds of adventures just like we did today with Miss Shelly McBubbles but anyhow you know at the end of our show we always do one thing and that's the yeehaw and you're already dressed right for it mm. you think you could do the yeehaw I with think me? I can I all would right. love to let's count them off one, one two, two three, three. yeehaw <laughs>